Hello everyone, Uncle Tech here. I have a 12 volt AGM battery here that was used on the previous Gen 3. The battery is dead, so I thought I would try to see if it is possible to restore it back to usable condition. Please note this is considered a fun project. That means it is in no way scientifically correct or the right way to restore battery. I'm just doing this for fun after seeing some other videos of others using their methods of battery restoration just trying to play around with the idea of restoring 12 volt batteries. First, let's check how dead is this battery. I'll plug this into my battery tester. Red for the positive. And black for the negative. In the option, select battery test. Then battery type would be AGM flat plate. For the CCA, it should be around 205. You see, it's written in the label of the battery over here. Yeah, CCA 204 amp, right? So 205 is close enough. OK, and proceed. State of health of 0%. Resistance for the 1 milliohm is too high. Deader than a dead fish. Let's start the restoration process. DIY my right? Let's go! Before we start dismantling the battery, make sure to wear protection. Glove and safety goggle is important as we are dealing with corrosive acid and electricity. Cut off the white panel which is strongly attached to the cover. This would allow us access to the screw plugs which we can open to see the inside of the battery. Looking inside, we see some liquid in there, the electrolytes, which are mostly acid. Note that AGM would have a lot less battery acid than flooded. That is because the electrolyte or acid are absorbed into the plates. Due to this, acid leaks are less likely on an AGM. Plus, my restoration method might not even work. We'll see. Let's move on. For my method of restoration, I will be using Epsom salt. I will dilute the salt into hot water. Once it is cool, pour it into the battery. Now we charge the battery using pulse method, which is supposedly able to remove sulfation from the battery plates. I don't know, let's try. After waiting for a day, moment of truth, let's check the voltage and CCA.
state of health is 85%, not bad. CCA is 190M, which is decent. Resistance is 12.89 milliohm. It's not great, but huge improvement from previously. So, is the battery now fit for usage? I put the battery through some cycle of load. Did a couple of discharge and charge cycle. Battery is back to square one, data than a dead fish. Conclusion, looks like battery restoration is a hit and miss thing. Maybe my steps was wrong or something I didn't do properly. Whatever it is, this was a fun learning process for me. Hope you also enjoyed this activity. Appreciate if you could subscribe so that I could be encouraged to do more videos on these experiments. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, Uncle Tech out.